The Supreme Court hearing arguments today on the abortion pill mifepristone and whether easier access to it should stay in place. The conservative majority court will consider the Biden administration's appeal of lower court rulings that restricted access to the pill. New data from the Guttmacher Institute Research Group shows nearly two thirds of all abortions in the U.S. rely on mifeprestone. Abortion rights groups say the drug's been proven safe and that the court should confirm the FDA's ruling broadening access to it, especially as the justices repealed the nationwide right to abortion two years ago. From 2000 on, including in 2021, uh, FDA acknowledged that the restrictions, uh, the safeguards that it was removing on the abortion drug would mean that more women suffer harm and end up in the emergency room. Anti-abortion organizations counter the FDA has unlawfully promoted a nationwide regime of on-demand abortion in defiance of several state health and safety laws. For now, the Supreme Court is allowing the FDA to continue regulating the drug while the appeals process plays out. That includes continued telemedicine prescriptions and retail pharmacy dispensing. There's a possibility that the court will address the Comstock Act, which is an, a 19th century obscenity law, which some abortion opponents are hoping the Trump administration, if there is the second Trump administration will treat um, as a, a de facto ban on all abortions. A ruling in this case is expected by June. At the Supreme Court, Rich Edson, Fox News.